Okay, so so we're talking now about uh, about a direct drive. So we're making we, we have a cam that's making a motion, and there is no mechanical anything that is that is uh, that's providing cushion or, or or giving the needle any place to go except for that full rotation that it has to make, right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah. So you've got this circular cam with the needle ha having to go all the way to the end before it can come back. So this is the top part of its stroke, bottom, and there's no way of cutting that short. You have to go all the way down in order to come back up. Right. And so that, if we're calling that digital give, meaning that the machine slows down, which slows the speed of the rotation, that's really not correct at all because there is no give. It's making the full motion. Give would mean that it's cutting that motion short in some way, right? Or at least is able to get cut it short in some way. If we're defining, yeah, if we're going to be defining give based on what we know from coils, because that's where that word comes from. It comes from the coil world. So it doesn't seem reasonable to me to use that same word unless we're defining it in the same way, right? Otherwise, we're just, why don't I want to just call a rotary a coil? Because it's using a coil too, right? So if we're going to, we have to be able to agree on the language so that we can understand what we're talking about. So yes, I think that um, that's my way of saying, yeah, that that's not give. It's bogging, it's, it's changing the, the speed of the motor, that's all. So let's co contrast or compare that with a rotary motor that does have some type of mechanical give, whether that's mm -hmm. a cushion like you were showing in what I assume is the previous episode will drop in, or whether it's built into uh, you know an, an armature bar or a plunger that has yep. some type of uh, dampening system built into it. Yep. Okay. So now, um, the so now a couple things are happening. So the idea is, or we think we thought when I I believe that. When give was created, the idea behind it was to replicate the coil and what was happening with that, mm -hmm. which is why we called it give, right? Because that was what, you know, the reason that give is even a conversation to begin with is that when people started using rotaries, they were like, screw this thing. It has no give. Mm -hmm. And they were talking about their coil. The coil has give. It backs off. So what it, what it is doing, if it, it is accomplishing that the needle... If this is the needle um, on a rotary, let's say this is the stroke, you know, from here to here, um, it has to go here before it can come back. It cannot go here and back on a rotary. It has to go all the way. So with a mechanical give, we are achieving that it doesn't have to go all the way here. But because, on, because it's a rotating motor, what we're doing is we're creating this shortcut in the in the cam only on the part where it's touching in, into skin so what was once a circle is now kind of flattens out on one side that kind of a shape right and so now if you look at like let's say you're tattooing one millimeter deep you're you're uh you know the amount of time you spend is these two lines here but if you look at that one you know now you're tattooing the same depth and you can see that the time frame is much longer. Mm -hmm. So that's what we talk about when we're, when we're saying dwell time. We're saying that, you know, whereas the, uh, the we were, we're doing something like this basically on a rotary. Mm -hmm. So instead of my cam having to go all the way forward like that, it's cutting the corner and then round and then cuts the corner. But while it's cutting that corner, it's crossing over. It takes time for that to happen. And the needle's in its extended position at that point. Mm -hmm. And so although you're backing off, you still want to tattoo to a certain depth. And so the needle's still in the skin. And so basically the short version of what I'm trying to say is that mechanical give is harsher on the skin than a direct drive. And, the, and that's, the, that's the messed up part because the only reason to desire give in a rotary mm -hmm. is to reduce the amount of trauma that's being done because we're complaining that the needle has to go all the way forward before it can go back, right? Mm -hmm. But if, if what we're doing is we're making it worse, then we screwed ourselves in the process.